is Lana's Enchanted Sky, your spiritual fairy godmother, bringing you your Sagittarius reading for finance and career for April 2022. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading hypnosis. Whatever I do, also visit EnchantedSky.com. You can book a reading. Also, please visit uh, Metaphysical Mandarin. <laughs> Metaphysical Meanderings, that is my podcast, on uh, Saturday mornings, 9.30 a.m. Central on 216thenet.com, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Joke of the day. So, you know, I get so mad when my phone dies, but my therapist told me I just need another outlet. There's your joke. Okay, so you're trying to get something going this month. Now, remember, I'm a fellow Sag. You're trying to get something going, and you're trying to be optimistic, and you got something crisscrossing you that's, you know, that's kind of, you know, possibly uh, an argument, um, something that's going on, and it's crossing you, and it's just in your way. Now, there was an offer of some sort of money some some point this month, this last couple months. And there is a change coming. Now, this could also be legal, but but it's usually just a change because I see that we have another card of change. Now, you're, be strong and see this through because there is a new start coming. Now, is this a person? Could be, as I'm going to show you in a minute. Now, it's a new start. Death is not a death. It's a new start. And But yet you're feeling you're sitting on something. You're waiting for something. You're you're kind of going, I'm going to start that. I want to say you're hemming and hawing. But look it, you've got the best card in the deck coming. So this, whatever you're doing, do it. It's going to work out. Now, there was a message that's come. It's a creative message that's come to you. Now, this is usually written. Um, it could even be snail mail. And this card upside down is a shock of blow, but it's not as severe. It's almost the exact same meaning as this card. Okay, so whatever it is, something's coming your way. Now, I want to say something is still hidden and not completely. You're expecting something to not be completely revealed yet as you're going through all of this. And you're expecting that. Now, there's been a lack of planning, but I feel like you're lift now, you are breaking loose of something. You are breaking free. Um getting rid of the restraints, figuring out what you need to do. Now, this can be a, not a very nice person coming into your life to wreak havoc. But it could also be what for you inside that you're your own worst enemy. So just to let you know. And you're not getting going. I want to say this month might be a little bit of stagnation because you're weathering a storm and there's been stress. So... I want to say that you didn't go through with what you're saying. You know, it's in your head, rattling around in there, and you just haven't gone through with it. I don't say so much that you are procrastinating, but I think you've got plans and you're just not executing them yet. And you're trying to break free from other things, maybe even low self-esteem. There's something you're trying to get rid of. You're trying to cut yourself loose from. You're trying really hard to do that. And you're having a very hard time. Okay. This also could be addiction. So this could be a, you trying to release yourself from an addiction. And you are finally, finally getting some progress. Because I don't, because I see like the sun is here. So it's you kind of sitting, trying to, trying to get forward, trying to go forward. Okay. Now. A win-win is in your forecast. So this, you are going to be successful at this. It's just, I want to say you're spinning your wheels. You're trying to go forward. Don't let pride get in your way. Accept your faults. That's the easiest way to, to be successful is to accept your faults, right? Nothing will come out of this situation. No, nothing bad is going to come out of any of this. Okay? Remember, I got a sun card. Step out of your comfort zone. That could be you trying to break free of your addiction. And it could be as small, an addiction as small as I'm addicted to Coca-Cola. It could be addiction as bad as heroin. It's some type of addiction that's affecting you. And that the fact that you're having a hard time getting going, trying to stick with it, trying to get out of it. But something is coming to you to shake you, 
to make you awake to what is going on and how to break yourself, okay? Be bold and make the first move. And your emotions are very, very high right now, okay? Now, I am a fellow, fellow Sag. I partake that this person could be a, not a, such a nice person in my life. But I'm also partaking that this could be my own worst, I, my own worst enemy. I'm partaking it to be that, okay, for myself. You can figure out what I'm talking about for yourself because remember, I read for many, many people. All right, so I'm going to worry another day. Worry another day. I just know that it is going to work out. Even though you're sitting on something and you're waiting for things to happen, you've got the go-ahead. This card means yes. Blessings to you. Make it a great month. 